Good afternoon. Today we will talk about the topic bond and stock market. Our group has four members, Dung, Zhang, Huyan, Gia Lin. In the video, we will clarify some key points. Firstly, it is the financial market. Next one is Vietnam's bond market, and then the stock market. Now let's look at the financial market. We divide it into bond and stock market. Bond is a certificate of indebtedness. In the bond market, the bondholder is usually a lender. By contrast, the stock is the claim to partial ownership in a firm, so it is said that shareholder is an owner. More about the term bond and stock, we make a comparison between them. Firstly, bond. In the bond market, firms and government are the two main issuers. The bondholders can gain fixed interest rate. At the end of the maturity date, the principal will be repaid. Bond has a lower return, and if firms go bankrupt, creditors will be paid returns. Bond stock, the stock is issued mainly by the firm. As similar as bond, shareholders gain dividends. The stock market does not have a maturity date, but it has a higher return. If having bankrupt, firm has liability to pay debts first, and the leftover will be paid to shareholders. Now, let's next to second part is bond market in Vietnam. The bond market provides local, state and federal governments, and private enterprises the funds needed to get development and long-term infrastructure projects off the ground. In addition to financing long-term infrastructure projects, bonds help governments manage cash flow, passing savings on to taxpayers who help the government pay for needed services. Close the main role bond market helps attract the capital source for the state budget, for the development in years ago. The part is a weakness of Vietnam's bond market and recommendation. First of all bond market in Vietnam has small scale compared with other countries in the area. In 2015, percentage GDP is 23.4%, while Thailand is 72.28% and Singapore is 82.46%. And we can see that almost bond issued is government bond. Corporate bond's position is very small while this type of bond has a large potential. Therefore, there should have more new products in the bond market such as sell buyback or allow to borrow bonds to sell. To increase the liquidity of bond and attract more investors. Secondly, maturity of government bond that is less than 5 years is approximately 75%. Therefore, the certainty and potential are not high. Finally, the corporate bond market has many difficulties. Bank are issue advisors also who buy all of the corporate bonds. Therefore, the liquidity in this market is very low. To encourage the corporate bond market, government should improve the law for firms to issue bonds, as well as reduce the procedures and condition to issue a bond. About corporate, they should create the transparency of their information to attract investors. Created you. The Vietnamese stock market, formerly known as the Securities Trading Center, STC, located in Ho Chi Minh City, was launched on July 28, 2000. The development of the stock market can be divided into four major time periods. First, from 2000 to 2004, the daily volume traded was low. Between 2004 and 2007 the number of listed companies increased. Starting from 2008, the global economic recession happened. Then, it recovered to 430. And now, we will show you some strengths of Vietnam stock market. Firstly, stock market in Vietnam encourage people to save and attract all the idle capital to invest. And then, it is a tool to help the state implement the program of socio-economic development. As well as attract and control foreign investment. Besides, the stock market can mobilize the domestic capital and also encourage businesses to do business properly. 
And now let's look at the weakness in Vietnam stock market. First of all, the market has policies which are not appealing to foreign investors. Snowball, CEO of Asset Management said that, Vietnam's economy seems to have it all good demographics, rising incomes, and growing consumption. She also said, but that's not good enough to translate into stock market gains. But what's good for Vietnam is foreign investors, who doesn't appear to be helping the domestic ones. Another shortcoming is market size and products, market liquidity, and debt. It is characterized by a large number of listed companies with low average capitalization. With about 50% of the listed companies having charter capital of less than 100 billion listed companies in the banking and insurance areas. They have large capitalization but low free float. On the document of World Bank, on the exchanges, products are undiversified, mainly consisting of stocks and government bonds, with few investment fund units listed. Let's talk about recommendation for Vietnam stock market. Join the linked market of ASEAN region and the world. Enhance the market efficiency. The derivatives and derivatives market are expected to be in operation by 2017. And thank you so much for watching our videos in our project.